Suppose that on this question, we start right at the top of the prompt and read straight through without checking the question stem first. That's not always a problem, although it should be one of our ironclad rules that we always hold back from looking at the answer choices involuntarily. Especially with an easy to understand argument, but pretty much always, we will force ourselves to make some sort of guess before going on to the answer choices. So, before everyone's extra day off was Friday, and now they can choose different days. The question is whether it will impact their productivity, or which would be most likely to decrease it. It's not a question of time exactly, because the total amount of time they're working is the same. Rather, it has to be something about how the work time is used. And we guess whether they all need to be doing it on Monday through Thursday for some reason. With that shred of a prediction, we can move on to the answer choices. A would help their productivity, so it's out, because with A, there would be fewer people in the office on average on a given day in the new model. So A is out. B is irrelevant, and C is also irrelevant due to the use of the word eventual. D looks correct, so we can come back to it. E is irrelevant because the projects would take several days. Confirming the logic of D, if they all have to interact with each other and they're all in the office at the same time less often, sure, they will be less productive most likely. The correct answer is D.